I'm Roger Stoop. I'm the Division Chief of uh, Neuro-Oncology in the Department of Neurology and uh, Medical Director of the Malnati Brain Tumor Institute. Glioblastoma is the most aggressive brain tumor. It uh, occurs at all ages, but more in the elderly, and it usually leads to patients succumbing to the disease within one to two years. Treatment uh, traditionally consists of surgery to the extent possible without doing any damage and, uh, and radiation. And that was the standard of care for over 20 plus years. So tumor treating fields is the latest innovation in cancer therapy. It uses physical force to actually interfere with dividing tumor cells. As it is completely different of all other treatments, it doesn't have any systemic toxicity. If there are side effects, it's some skin irritation locally, but other than that, it will not have any negative effect on the patient's general well-being. It also allows to combine tumor treating fields with any established treatment because it has no what we call overlapping toxicity. And we have demonstrated that patients who get treatment with tumor treating fields have a longer survival time, longer time until the tumor progresses or recurs and they live longer and better. So this is the beginning of a new era. So the tumor treating fields now is part of standard of care. We're still optimizing how to integrate it there is good evidence that it may be in combination with immune therapy and other treatments that are on the horizon, that there may be even a bigger improvement in outcome. So this is part of clinical trials and research that is ongoing. Over the last decade, decade and a half, we have developed new treatments and really made progress in the care of the patients, but also in treatment of the disease, allowing to prolong survival and improve quality of life. And we will not cease fighting, working together, until we can cure this disease.